All right, what is up YouTube? AbramSF here bringing you Paco 3 and we're gonna be discussing how to get a world record or at least one of the top 100 records in the game and one of the harder levels that is Melting Pot. As you can see, I'm number nine in the world and we're gonna be using the van. Yes, the van to get one of these really, really high scores. I mean, number nine in the world and it's super easy. You can do it today too if you're one of the first people to watch the video. It's definitely gonna be something you can do right now if you have this level unlocked. And it as as easy as doing this over and over and over again. And you can kind of, if you get good at doing this donut, then you can kind of readjust the van just a little bit here and there so you can get back on track. Hopefully you don't get hit in like the first 30 seconds like I just did. Um, I'll cut to one where it does a little bit better in just a minute. Um, but once you get going, once you get maybe to like the 45 second mark, some of the vehicles start driving a little bit faster and it's a lot harder for them to get to you. And of course I'm gonna show one where it actually worked really well. It's only like my sixth or seventh try. So just give it a few shots and once you get that donut down and you try a couple times, those cars will miss you and you will get a really high score just like this one. So check it out. All right, thanks past me. So this is the two minute and 20 second world record, I mean number nine in the world record on Paku 3. And uh, as you can see, I still hadn't even made it to the two minute mark yet when I started doing these donuts. But um, there was some parts here, yeah, that I really needed to adjust on and some other parts where I got a little bit lucky, but you don't have to get lucky that often to get a high score like this. Like I got some other high scores at like a minute, 45, two minutes, two minutes and five seconds um, after this one. I'm just testing it out, trying to get a feel for it, get these donuts just right. It's just really, really fun to just drive in circles and look at these cars <laughs> drive right into the lava around you. So here's one part where I had to get readjusted. And if I wasn't talking on my phone, I probably would have been able to adjust the intro to this video a little bit better. But trying to do these little adjustments at the same time that I was trying to talk is pretty darn difficult. But um, now once you get these donuts going and you figure out how to do the adjustments just a little bit, and with a little bit of luck, you can get a really high score. And if I had more time, I definitely could get an even high score. I know I could. Um, so hopefully that will give all of you a chance to get a super high score using this trick. I mean, you probably have the van unlocked. And if not, it is one of the tankier vehicles in the game. I definitely would go for this one. You can get a lot done with this vehicle until you get some of the really awesome later super fast vehicles in order to do some of the other challenges. But uh, yeah, oh, that got pretty lucky right there. A lot of them made it to the platform. And uh, I guess we're hitting up on the uh, minute and 45 seconds already. Wow. But um, yeah, just trying to drive in these donuts and getting a little bit close. I was gonna let it go as far as it possibly could go. But of course I got unlucky at one point and then it just had to end it for me, unfortunately. Um, but I really hope that uh, I can find a few other spots that work really, really well in this game. I did find one or two and I'll make some videos about it when I get them down a little bit better. Um, Cause some of the other levels have these little spots that just work really well. But this one is so cool to see all the vehicles just falling and dying around you. Anyway, that was the two minute, 20 second top 10 in the world. It's actually number nine now. It says number 20, but it was top, number nine now. Peace.